I was, you know, always have been such a big Bret Hart fan growing up. And the moment in the 1994 Royal Rumble when you both managed to eliminate one another, I mean, the did you practice that a lot? Because the timing of that is spotless. It's incredible. It was. And um, they said Vince McMahon jumped out of his chair in the back when, when, we, when we did it because we were all uh, a little nervous and apprehensive because we did the walkthrough, but you can't time that. No. You just got to do it. And, 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 and Brett, one of the greatest ever, the grace of ring, he was so confident. He gave me compliments because I, number one, I was, I was going back. He had to do all the work really in time because I was going backwards over the top rope. So he had to grab me as, and, and go over with me and, and, and hold me in tight and try to roll off the apron to the floor at the simultaneous. So Brett did almost all the work and his timing as the excellence of execution mm -hmm. as usual was flawless. They said that even that in the replay, slow mo, you couldn't tell who hit first. No. Absolutely amazing, unbelievable moment. I mean, we, Brett and I were, man, we hugged each other back and we were like, oh my gosh, can you believe it? And he was like, oh, I, we, were, we, were, oh, we were ecstatic. It was incredible. But, I mean, Great one, moment, Ben. The one feud I would have loved to have seen. Because it could have turned out really bad. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, but well, that I was mean, just a walkthrough before the crowd got in that day at, at the building incredible yeah that, that, that's true artistry right there isn't it oh my gosh thank you brett